Today, we are celebrating National Potato Chip Week with a taste test, which is such a hard chip. <laughs> Let's oh, get to it. It's a hard chip. <gasps> it's a hard chip. I like it. <laughs> Let's get to it. Let's get to it. <laughs> Okay, today's <laughs> Sample Saturday is on potato chips. If you have seen our our episode on Thursday, which you should have, we discussed potato chips in depth, whether sweet potatoes and chips should be included in National Potato Chip Day. We said yes. Yes. Uh, we also had the discussion of wavy versus flat, seasoned versus just salt. We went through the whole gambit. And we got a couple samples here, including a baked, Ooh. a classic, Sweet potato, sour cream and onion, which is one of my favorites, and the newer flavor that we mentioned on the episode, which is uh, what sweet is and spicy honey. Sweet and spicy honey. I said honey. sriracha, I think, in the yeah. Thursday episode, but it's sweet and spicy honey. So we <clears> had <throat> all these, and we're going to sample all of them. We have such a hard job. We love you guys. Yeah. It's, we're doing it for you. We sacrifice our palates so you don't have to. Yes. We we miss George today, but that means just means that there's more chips for us. Yeah. So, yeah. I don't mind. Okay. Let me get oh, some. Wait, 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 wait. Hi, George. Hi. <laughs> <laughs> You're a little mean. You know? I know. <laughs> okay. So, we he had, he had to go out. He had, couldn't be available for a potato chip week. Oh, well. Okay. Mm. So, I think we should start off with the original and classics first. And then work our way up. Oh, you want to do the baked first? I would almost yeah. say do the baked sweet potato last. Oh, that's true. Okay. Now let's do it like this order. There you go. Like that? Yeah. Okay. I'm for that. All, All right, right. So do we start from right or left? We do lightly salty. <laughs> I, I like the lightly salty ones now. Uh, those are really good. Um, I prefer them in waves, but I didn't, couldn't find them in the store when I went and got them. So. Ooh, I got a big chip. Yeah, that's these are big, big potato. These are big ones in the air. I was going right into it. Mm, I love this one. It has a great potato flavor because it's not overly salty. Yeah, this one has a uh, fifty percent less sodium. Mm -hmm. Which see. I appreciate. Mm -hmm. Oh god. And see, mm, it has a bit of a Pringles flavor. This is a perfect. Yeah, it does. This is a perfectly dippable chip. It's a little thin. I've tried dipping those. Mm. They're harder. They break easier. Just get sour cream. No, this solves that problem. This is sour cream and onion. Oh yeah. I mean, I don't think that you can. I think we've pretty much eaten the all these before. I don't think there's a bad chip here. Yeah. So I think we're just sampling them for fun. <laughs> <clears throat> yep, sour cream and onion is good. I like. I think this brand I like the best. Sour cream and onion because it's not overly salty. Yeah. The sour cream and onion, I um, can't remember what brand it is, but it's like, I can eat like three chips. It's like, I just couldn't eat anymore because they mm. were so heavily salted. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Oh, yeah. Mm-hmm. I'm starting to get my dance on. <laughs> well, this is one we tried recently. It is very spicy. And it is the newer flavor. Yeah, it is the newer the um, from the brand Lay's, sweet and spicy honey. <clears throat> It is. It has a lovely sweet flavor, but then the heat does build. Oh yeah, it, it it kicks in. I mean, you don't you don't get the heat at first. No, it just it's like really nice. It has, it has a, a bit of a smoky flavor too. It's sweet and smoky. Very pleasant. And then the heat builds. Mm -hmm. It's actually a very well put together <clears throat> flavor wise. Yeah. Yep. The heat's hitting. I think this is actually a chip that Jose would really like. Hmm. It probably would. Because he really likes spice, but he also <laughs> likes it when it builds. <coughs> and it built. It built too much, too fast. Now, this one I would recommend definitely having something like sour, sour cream, cream to or, cool it down. Yeah. That would be really good with sour cream. Perfect balance. But yeah, all three of those, those are like, I mean, they're classically good. Yeah. For us. Now, this, I have never tried these. Lay's Bakes. <clears throat> I don't think I have either. It has, um, what is it? 65% 65. 65. less fat and full flavor with 100% crispy goodness. Mm, 100%? I don't know about that. Mm, it's not good. I mean, it's a chip, but you know. Oh. Now, I, I think Pringles are, are baked, so this might taste close to a Pringle. They're different shapes, too. It actually looks more like a corn chip. What is that? 
It's a weird flavor. Hmm. Hmm. It's the same company. Is it like a different oil? I don't know. This is corn oil. What's this one? Ah, uh, vegetable, vegetable oil. Canola, corn, soybean, or sunflower. Hmm. That's weird. It's, um, I'm trying to think of what it reminds me of. Kind of a combination of Pringles and... It's thicker than a cream, Pringles. No, you know what it reminds me of? Remember those um, uh, um, dried vegetable sticks that we used to get in Harrisonburg when we travel? Yes. It reminds me of those. It does. Those were, uh, those were they were dried vegetables and uh, had everything from string beans. I think it's to, actually the, the Terra brand that does something like that. Yeah, they do. It kind of reminds me of that. I like it, but I think I would still choose this mm -hmm. flavor-wise over these because it has them. Has an after it, it, coating. It reminds me. The flavor reminds me of like an um, a slightly green potato. That are plantains. Mm, yeah. Although this would probably be perfect for something like um, nachos. Yeah, because it's flatter, and it's thicker. harder, thicker. Come on. <laughs> All right, and these are sweet potatoes. We d we determined <clears throat> on um, you know, Thursday's like episode. That sweet potatoes can be allowed in National Potato Chip Week. I said potato chip, yes. I'm having, I'm having trouble saying chip for the last few days. I don't know why. Yeah. Um, so these are Terra brand uh, sea salted sweet potato chips. And it's non-GMO. Yeah, Terra's a really good brand. Yeah. I think they're also considered you know, just non-GMO. I thought they were organic, too. <clears throat> Ready? Ready? Mm. Not burnt. Yeah. I think this is the brand. Really good oil flavor. Mm -hmm. No aftertaste. Yeah, because I mentioned thir on Thursday's episode that there's some brands that almost always taste like they've been overcooked. Mm -hmm. Like the oil's been burnt. I think Terra is actually one of the only brands where it never has had that for me. Wow, that's a really good chip. Mm -hmm. now, I'm usually not a big fan of um, um, sweet potatoes like eating like roasted. I'm just, I don't know, I've just never really, like, I, never, I don't know why. I never got that. It's weird. But I've just never really been a huge fan um, of that or butternut squash, really. Yeah, I can understand that. That's a squash after all. Hmm. Now, how would we rank them? I would say let's do it like best to worst. Okay. Um, I would say the baked is my least. Hmm. The classic. The sweet potato, sour cream. Just because I wouldn't eat these every day, the sweet and spicy, mm -hmm. I like them every once in a while. But I think I would, I would eat them like that. Okay. I would say... And I'm not saying they're bad. Right. I, I'm not right. saying this one's bad. It just wasn't my preference. It's the fifth best. <clears throat> there you go. I would say for my order... Because I usually prefer flavor over not having flavor. Mm. I would say green onion, sour cream. Okay. Sweet potato. Okay. Classic. Oh, wow, really? I'd probably say that. And I'd leave that last only because I am not a spicy fan. It was something that you would eat. Very, like very I had those the other day. I put them on top of a little bit on top of my salad. Mm, yeah. I had a little crunch and some spice to it. So that was kind of nice. <clears throat> yeah. Okay, so sweet potato chips for us when they rank second. Yeah, all of these were in our both of our top three. Yeah, cool. Okay, I, yeah. I, just, I mean, I, I don't know if we have to good. need to rank it fifth and stuff because. Oh right, yeah, the one in one, one through five. five. Yeah, I don't, I, I don't think we're gonna rank them this time just because. Yeah, we love potato chips. I don't think there's really one I've ever had that I didn't like except for like, um, like I said, a really salty sour cream and onion. It just it just wasn't my yeah. preference. Yeah, I've um, never I've never met a potato chip that I wouldn't be friends with. <laughs> <laughs> well, let us know. <laughs> let us know in the comments below what your favorite potato chip is. If there's a brand we haven't tried that you think we should. I know most of these were Lay's. Mm -hmm. They were what was on sale at the store. <laughs> um, but let us know if there's a specific brand or if there's a flavor that's kind of wacky that you think we should try and see what our opinion is on that flavor. Yeah. I mean, next time, George will not miss out on that. Or maybe he will. Yeah. <laughs>
<laughs> Till next time. <laughs> Till next time. Ah, uh, we have to cheer. Let's let's cheer National Potato Chip Day. Boink. Have a good one. Thank you for joining us this sample Saturday. Is there a product you have a question about? Or maybe you have a suggestion for a future sampling? If so, post them on Sample Saturday's Facebook page. Till next time, this is Sample Saturday, brought to you by Fit Bodies Unlimited. Get fit, stay fit.